Select a character. Hello everybody, Super Baby Mario here. Welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure. In the last part, we finished Sonic's story by taking down Egg Viper. And Eggman just kind of buggered off after that. And in this part, we're going to start Tails' story! Here I come, Sonic! So, um, Tails' story largely just kind of follows behind what Sonic is doing. Because they're basically doing the same thing for most of the thing. But there are some differences, which we will see later, I guess. But first we have Plane. Working great. All systems go full speed ahead. Rut row. Uh oh, what's this? Did you forget to... Wow. Did you forget to put gas in your plane again, Tails? Zoom! I'm out of control! Mayday! Mayday! Wow, those those are some crazy maneuvers there, Tails. Going down, and then back up, and then back down, and then back up. Who knows? And then we get to hear the Emerald Coast theme for two whole seconds. Hi, how you doing? You're you're a hedgehog and stuff. And completely unnecessary scene transition. Because can. Boy, you're lucky I saw you come down. So what went wrong, anyway? It's not like you to crash like that. Yeah, it's just that I'm testing a new prototype power supply, and it's not fully compatible yet. You can always borrow my plane, the Tornado, if you want. Thanks, Sonic. But if I can make this work, it'll run circles around yours. Check out this power supply! Ta-da! It's a Chaos Emerald! No way! I was lucky to find one of the seven Chaos Emeralds. No kidding. Unlimited mystic power. Now I want to harness that power to fly my plane. Zoom. Let's go to my workshop in the Mystic Ruins, and I'll show you what I've been working on. No, I don't want to. Go to the station, hop on a train, and get there in no time. So, yeah, as you may have noticed, uh, that cutscene had uh, slightly different dialogue than it did in Sonic's story. And that's something I kind of enjoy about this game, is that even though uh, some characters might share the same scenes, they, for the most part, have different dialogue, and they're more so, like, shown from the perspective of the character you're playing as, which I think is kind of neat. Anyways, uh, before we head to the Mystic Ruins, we want to come over here and fly up this thing. I, I don't even know what this is supposed to be. Whatever. Here we get Tails' first of two upgrades. Get the thing, Tails. God. Ooh, it's shiny. Look, it's your jet anklet. Its jet power makes you fly faster. Yay! That's gonna... maybe come in handy? It... it, it might be useful at some point? I, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, Tails' upgrades are cool, but they're not really needed for much of anything. The train headed for the I mean, at least Sonic, uh, like, uses his upgrades on a fairly regular basis. Well, more so the Lightspeed shoes than the, uh, the Ancient Light, but whatever. Although flying faster is definitely nice to have. 
Case in point, ZOOM! And cutscene. Well, well, well. If it isn't Sonic and Tails. It's Eggman! Silence! I am Dr. Robotnik, the most cunning scientific genius in the world! Yeah, right, Dr. Eggman. Enough! I've been working on a master plan, but now it's time to put it to work! That usually means trouble coming from you! Don't even try to interfere this time. Give me that Chaos Emerald, or else... No thanks, I'm good. I want to keep that. Or else what, huh? Or else I'll take it from you the hard way. So yeah, as you saw there, Eggman sounded a lot more menacing from the perspective of Tails. Which... I always thought was pretty cool. He's still not threatening in the slightest in this hunk of stuffs, but at least he sounds the part, I guess. Whatever, let's let's blow up a giant robot again. And unfortunately, we didn't do a stage first, so we don't get to keep our rings from the stage that we didn't do like Sonic did with Emerald Coast. Zoom. And then you boop. So yeah, um... Tails, if you press B while standing still, if I can ever stand still, he will do this weird tail swipe thing. And But if you do it while he's running, then he's like, boop! Um, that wasn't shown particularly well. He's just all like, "Wee!" And obviously he can fly. Because he's Tails. That's what he do! Wee! Hey, guess what? I can fly higher than you! Suck it! And then land on him? Nope. Can't blame me for trying, I guess. So yeah, that boss was as easy as ever. Luckily, that is the last time we will ever have to fight it. Boom. 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 What, what are those clouds supposed to be? Are they like dust? That was just too easy. No, Tails, what are you doing, you idiot? Gotcha. Hey, he it. Tails, why did you turn around? He would have had a much more difficult shot if you hadn't turned around. Could use a little snap. Who's chaos? Welcome back, Blobman. Nice to see you again. That's the monster I saw the other day. Monster? Oh no, it's bigger Blobman. Yes, yes, it's really happening. Just the stone tablet said it would. <laughs> Hear this, Sonic. There's the freaking green glow again, by the way. Every time I still have no idea what that is. All he needs is seven emeralds to become invincible. Then he will turn Station Square into rubble, upon which I will build the ultimate city, Robotnik Land. I don't think you will, actually. You ready, Chaos? Let's go to the next one. Come on. That's kind of the downside to the more menacing aspect of Eggman's voice in this story, is that sometimes you have trouble hearing him. But that's what subtitles are for, right? Good written. We can't let that monster get any bigger. It could get ugly. It's already pretty ugly, I would say. Chaos must be stopped. And he can be if we keep him away from more emeralds, right? So what do you say, Sonic? Let's find the Chaos Emeralds before Eggman does. So yeah, uh, like I was saying before, Tails, for at least the first half of his story... 
Walking through the windstone. P pick up the damn thing. But yeah, for the first, at least the first half of his story, Tails is going to be doing the exact same stages and the exact same bosses as Sonic was. Which, uh, is kind of lame, but at the same time it does make sense, given the main as aspect of Tails' stages, which will be shown in approximately five seconds. So, Tails' stages are entirely composed of races against Sonic, with one exception, which we won't see for a while, but uh, Tails don't get stuck. Good lord, boy. But yeah, uh, they're literally just races against Sonic, which is why it does make sense that he does the same stages as Sonic does, but... It's still kind of silly. Hurry up, Tails. D shut up, Sonic. I'm trying to talk here. Emphasis on trying because I have no idea what I'm saying at this point. Boing. Um, go fly, fly like a Tails to the sea. No, this is more so the sky, I would say. Ah! Hey, hey, hey! Wow, am I just barely ahead of him? You'd think he'd be overtaking me, what with being the fastest thing alive and everything. But yeah, those, uh, green rings that you see, just kind of littering the stage, if you fly through them, then they will give you a large burst of speed, and I do not know why I haven't been doing such things, but, uh, yeah. Chaos Emerald. Yeah! Also, I, I don't really know why Tails has to find things before Sonic. Maybe it's just kind of to prove to himself that he can function without Sonic, and I, I don't even know. Mystic Ruins Adventure Field, go! So, when in doubt, go back to Station Square. The train headed for Station Square will be departing soon. Well, how convenient! Uh, to get, go in the train, Tails. Station Square. Alright, so... Uh, pay no attention to the emblem over there. Just like Sonic, going into Casinoopolis. But we're not going into the actual casino portion of Casinoopolis. We are instead going... Come on. Load. Please. Straight into the garbage! So yeah, this is probably the easiest of Tails' stages, if I'm being honest. Because it's basically just a straight path with no real easy way to screw up, unless you hit several of the things. Or walls, which... I, 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 come on. Come on now, door. Hey, Tails! Ay, 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 ay! Hey, hey, hey! Um... Let's, let's fly. Let's fly! Tails! 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 What are you doing, boy? So, um... Remember what I said about this being Tails' easiest stage? We have already lost, I, I do believe. Yep. I got it. And Tails falls on his ass in midair. Come on, Tails. 
I'd, I'd just like to point out that that is the first time I've ever lost one of these races. So... Yeah, that's that's a thing. Let, let's try that again. Let's go zoom. Let's go zoom. Let's not run into any walls this time. D stop running into walls, Tails! You made it! It's Sonic! Here we go. Now we can actually do things like a good little fox. And just fly straight to the end. Uh, after landing on spikes. Yeah! Woo! <laughs> it really was, actually, Tails. TBH. Hey, yeah, guess what? It's the Ice Stone. Can we walk through that one, too? Well, not yet, because we have to get our emerald stolen first. Really, Tails? Come on. Get away from there. Ah! Oh, no! He shot purple shit at me! Eggman! To the Chaos Emerald. We fucked it up. Uh, Eggman got one of them, but the other one's safe. He must be getting desperate. Now the Emerald Count is two to one, and Eggman's winning. Let's get a move on. Yes, let's. So, Ice Stone. Let's let's just grab that again. Oh, this this one's actually a solid object. Imagine that. Back to Mystic Ruins we go. Gotta love the convenience of the trains always being about to leave while you're at the station. Just any time you're at the station, even if it's just a er, yeah, even if it's just arrived. Speaking of convenience. Yay! So, jumping up the rocks again. Whee! And doing the same thing again. And taking ladders is for chumps. Um. I said taking ladders is for chumps. Uh, really? I have to be on the ladder in order to enter the stage? God damn it, game. Come on, so, snowboarding race, go! This one is also quite easy. There's no real way to lose unless you run into, like, every single wall there is. So, yeah, just just kind of have fun with it. Let's see if I can actually go off any of the ramps this time. That would be nice. But yeah, as you'll see, Sonic is ahead of us. That's not going to last for very long. Zoom! Because Sonic runs into every single wall imaginable. Yay! D and then teleports! Oh, come on, I pressed A. Thank you, game. Much appreciated. Woo! Perfect 
do. But yeah, jumping off the ramps also gives you a large burst O speed. So it is a good idea to do that as many times as you possibly want to. Yes, I realize that that didn't make sense. Whatever, ignore me. So, uh, as you may have noticed, Tails' stages are basically just shortened versions of Sonic's stages. Which is... kind of... lame. Because not only does Sonic have by far the most stages in the game, but uh, he also has the longest stages. So... yeah. Yeah! yeah! But yeah, as you, as you saw, Sonic has ten stages. Nobody else in the game has more than five. So... I don't, I don't even know where I was going with that. Anyways, that'll be it for this episode. So next time on Let's Play Sonic Adventure, we're gonna go and beat up Knuckles again. Because that's the fun thing to do in this game, is beat up on your friends because they're being assholes. So thank you all for watching, and we will see... You, I will see you next time. There, there's no we involved in this. Take care, everybody.